Welcome back to this fortnight's edition of the Inside Track after last night's GDT auction. Uh, we'll take a look at the main product groups and, and see what that means this time around. Uh, starting off with full cream milk powder. Full cream uh, increased 4.1% on last night's auction. There was around about 13,000 tonnes of product on the auction, so uh, similar volumes to last event. Uh, all contract periods were up with contract period 5, uh, August being the strongest up some 6.2% uh, from memory. Um, just shows really strong demand for full cream milk powder and people probably forward buying, uh, predicting that there's going to be a, a bit of a shortage or drought coming into the end of the season. Moving on to those dairy fats now, um, AMF came off about 3.1%, um, but a huge uh, increase for, for butter again, 9.3% uh, I think there, just showing uh, that real worldwide demand for um, butter fats. May and June period uh, were the strongest contracts, so again showing that for a promptish sort of supply, the, the really strong demand. Um, butter it, it continues to be dynamic and uh, we will keep our eye on that and, and help our customers out where we can. On to cheddar cheese now and, a, and another increase of 4% on cheddar. So if you look at this 12 month graph, uh, you'll see that that's a really strong uh, trajectory there over the last seven events really. And if you take a look at this five year graph, you can see that it, it, it's quite possible and plausible that, that cheddar could get back to those highs of mid-2014. Uh, we'll keep an eye on cheddar too. Let's take a look at skim milk powder now. Uh, skim went uh, a little bit against the trend of this GDT with some more settling or recalibrating um, a downward adjustment of 2.4%. Um, it looks like some of that uh, European intervention stock could be finding its way physically into the market now. Also, European spring is starting, a uh, nice start to the spring over there. So buyers in that region could be sitting back a little bit, uh, waiting for some good milk flow and, and some good skim milk pricing off the back of that in the coming months. Looking at whey powder now, and uh, no whey offered up on the auction again. So not really too much to report there. Numbers are fairly stable, uh, and there's some um, product around if you need it. Uh, and quickly, buttermilk powder, uh, the same as whey, uh, nothing offered. But we do know that uh, buttermilk powder in Oceania prices sort of rallied to the highest they've been for some time, and supply is quite tight. Uh, that's it for this edition of the Inside Track. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you in a couple of weeks after the next GDT auction. Thanks.